there's a lot of stuff that could be there that's maybe turned off or on depending on your, you know, experiences and your family and where you grow up. And, you know, there's just, there's a lot of things I think that play into it, but mm. yeah, something like that with, um, there's lots of diagnoses I think out there that all of us, I think you take any woman after she's had a baby and there's a pretty good chance there's going to be depression and anxiety going on sure. hormones, sure. all sorts of stuff, you know, mm. like there's just a lot of things that are just normal responses. They don't need to be pathologized, you know, yeah. anyway. Don't need to be labeled. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, mm. yeah, it's just, it's about um, recognizing that we're all a bit, we're all a bit weird, but that weirdness yeah. <laughs> is actually yeah. really healthy because if you stand back enough, you go, okay, I'm in a body. I've no idea how I got in here. We're also going to die. And what the hell does that mean? How the hell do I just get the energy to take the bins out? Like who cares when I'm going to die? And I don't know what that means. Like you stand back far enough. None of it makes any sense. So I understand where that need for certainty and disorders and labels, you know, it can come from. And we also, you know, Hey, we've given the devil his due. We've, We've given it a crack on the show, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I kind of, I kind of knew we were going to come here at the end, but um, it is. But I think it's, I think it's helpful though for people to hear us talk about it that are maybe not sure if I want to get a diagnosis or I want to get my kid assessed or, um, you know, I'm not sure. I'm curious about it. What does it actually mean? Is it mm. helpful? I think it's good to hear this kind of different perspective because. Um, I think we're giving people permission to live in the gray and you don't have to be black and white, you know, like that you yeah. can, you can get a diagnosis and go, cool, I'm going to file that one away in my head or for my kid. Doesn't mean that on every piece of paperwork that I submit to their ballet class and their fourth grade, you know, teacher I'm writing, they are on the spectrum or they have ADHD. Yes. Like you don't, it doesn't need to be, you know, marketed or not marketed what's the word it doesn't need to broadcast it doesn't need to be broadcast everywhere unless it helps you unless it serves you and that's the thing i think with diagnoses is you don't have to tell anyone unless you think it will help you 